That's a first for me. What you doing? Hi. I am packaging fresh cake. I got lucky enough to... Oh, that was a big one right down there. Yeah, tarpons. Tarpons in here. They're all... Got lucky enough to get some fresh bait here in Grenada. Getting down to the bottom of the barrel. Sorting and packaging. Mediums and smalls. Get a nice looking. Oh, well, just finished up down here doing some maintenance in the engine room. Uh, some of the welds on pulley cover right here. It usually attaches right here and down there. They weren't looking too good, so I took those off. Had to adjust the belts anyway, but that's what it's supposed to look like. So I'm gonna get somebody to tack weld those together. But um, anyway, um, just you know, doing general maintenance, getting ready to go do some fishing. And typically this time of year, sail fish are thick. I haven't been out in a little bit because there's not much going on around here with uh, COVID and all that, but we're gonna give it a try. So hopefully the salvage bite good for us. And yeah, see how it goes. Keep reeling. Go ahead, go get on the other, get on them again. Well, here we are. In Grenada, chasing tuna. Where do you wait? <laughs> Started the morning with two uh, Weehoos and one Mahi, and we see a lot of birds ahead, and it looks like elephants. So, hopefully, game on.
position at its finest. <laughs> Boom! Oh, oh, man. Love it. Got him all and shoot him! When it was getting towards the end of the day, it was around 2 p.m. We were 5 for 7 on Yellowfin to this point, plus uh, two bonus Wahoo and Amahi. So we were having an awesome day. All the fish were nice ones, like 110 up to 165 pounds. So we were super stoked. We were just going to give it one more crack at them and see if we could uh, catch one more because we were just having too much fun catching them. And got one on on a bridge rod. And then as we were starting to settle down, realizing we weren't going to get a double, uh, we had a couple dead baits out, and we were just starting to slowly clear lines, and bam, there was the right short rigger. Finally, double header, and uh, that was actually on the chair rod, so I switched that rod with Chris, and I took the other one, and it was just pretty wild from that point on. Um, it was just me and Chris in the pit, and Steve upstairs on the boat, and uh, it was a lot of fun. I mean, Chris put it to him quick, and I put my rod and rod holder, we kept that one tight. Stuck uh, Chris's fish, got it in, and then went back to my rod and yeah, finished that one off and left the bite. Really awesome day. So much fun. Yeah, we caught a few today. Woo. We are in Grenada, going to Seven Sisters Waterfall.
back's gonna be a little tricky, but you know, for this thing. <laughs> well, we are off to Curacao. Woo! Bye, Grenada. <laughs> Steady. Come, Steve, yell on. I'm dead. <laughs> now take it. Now take it. <laughs> now fucking take it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, come on, try again. That's gonna be threatening you now.